light go where it likes. So now for this shot, I am going to use just a trace of right hand side. So I managed to cut the red into the centre there, and that's the first shot so far that I've played with side. I haven't played any other shots apart from that one with side. And now what I've actually got is blue to the top corner there. So I've produced a good pot to keep it going. I'm nice and straight on the blue. So it's just a run through shot on the blue. Which I've potted. And I'm now nicely on this red to the corner. And all this is now is just a delicate screw shot. Just too old for the pink, so nothing special with it. I'm not, again, not going to play with any side at all. Just a delicate screw shot, just too old. So now I've for the pink. The pink will go back on its spot. So what I'm actually going to do now is just bring the white over its spot, sort of in this area. So now I've got this red and this red. So I'm actually playing for two reds. There's the pink to the centre. Now because I haven't finished good on this red, I'm nice on this red. So that's why I was playing for two reds there in a position to get me on two. Again, keeping it nice and simple. So this one now, very soft screw shot, just too old for the black. See there, I've for the black nicely. Again, no side. Through all the balls I've potted so far, the only one I potted with side was the pin cut to the centre. So again, now just a nice stun shot on the black with the red at the bottom. No side again, just a nice stun shot, just come off nicely. And now I've got a nice position on this red, I think, just to run it in. It's a little bit straighter than I would like, so what I'm going to have to do is just play the top, just a little bit extra pace just to come off one, two cushions, and out for the black. And if I get into it too good, I could even finish on the pink. So just a nice, nice run through, so I'll bring the white out. So again, keeping it simple, this is just a stun shot, and all I'm going to do now is just bring the white, say in this area, so I've got this red, to the centre pocket. Again, keeping it simple. slightly off straight, so what I'm going to have to do now, I can't play for the pink, so I'm going to have to play a screw shot and bring it back to the black. So again, just a screw shot, keeping it nice and simple, nice and easy. So I've screwed it back for the black, and now to keep it nice and simple with the black, just a nice run through to bench the white off the rail there, somewhere in this area, so I'm on this red nice and easy to the centre. On the red nicely to the centre. So now it's just a case of just a nice stun down for the blue. Again, centre of the white, centre line of the white. So now I'm nicely on the blue. I think I might have to come a little bit straight on this blue. You can see there. a little bit too straight on the blue, but straight on the light, so just a nice run through. An almighty kick on the white there, and that's why it slowed the white down. But I've got a nice angle on the yellow, so I'll run the yellow through. Put the camera out so we can probably get it in there so you can see it. Need the rest, but again. Just top of the ball all day, just a nice run through. So I'll pop the yellow, try and get myself on the green. A nice pop there. Again, I haven't used any side or anything. Try and get everything in shot so you're not cheating. So again, now I'm just slightly off straight on the green. 
Now, I could play the screw shot here. The only problem with playing the screw shot is if you don't get into it enough, you'll have lit the brain. So just to keep it simple, top of the ball, and just a nice easy cue through the ball, and just a run through. You see that I've run through nicely. Probably run it through a little bit too far. So, back to the rest again. So just a nice stun shot on the brown. Again, no side, just enough to just pop the brown nicely and come up for the blue. Now what I have done all the way through the back end of this break here with the colours, I've made a little bit of a meal of it. Because I haven't played too good of shots there. And what you need to try and do again, as I said earlier on, is just keep it easy, nice and simple. So again now on the blue, just a nice plain ball pot. Nothing special, just nice and plain. Bring it up for the pink. Again, not the best shot I've ever played in the world. So, if this is your match, whenever you play your match night, again, you want to keep it as simple as you can. So what I'm going to do now is just pop the pink and leave myself the finish black. Again, just plain ball striking. I've left myself a little bit of a tricky black, as you can see there. So I'm just going to keep it as simple as I can and just try and cut it in. Again, no side, no nothing, just a nice cut. And that there is the clip that you asked for, Matty. Uh, and I've tried to explain every shot as well as I could, but the one thing to notice is out of the reds that I had on, I think I, had, I didn't have the full set of reds on. I only had 11 reds on, I think, or something like 11 or 12 reds. So that there is, uh, if we say it's 11 reds, 11 colours, that's 22, plus the 6, that's 28 shots. Out of the 28 shots I played in that entire break, wherever it, it was, uh, score-wise, I'm not quite sure. Uh, thank you, there you are, that's how many it was. Um, I, I only played one shot with side and that's most important you mustn't try and play with side too much because it'll, it'll just make a mess of what you're trying to achieve uh, it's been Snooker Pro Tips thank you for listening, thank you for watching I hope you enjoy watching that little break the colours didn't quite go as I would have liked because uh, I made a little bit of a meal of it but as long as I kept the game simple keeping it nice and straight then I potted all the balls that were on the table. Uh, if it is, that's not acceptable to some of you and you want to see something else, please let me know uh, and I'll do my best to do something a little bit more difficult if, you, if it's required. Super Pro Tips, thank you for listening, thank you for watching, thank you.